We turn now to a traveler turned sleuth who helped police track down his missing luggage using air tags. Our transportation correspondent Gio Benitez joins us with more about how to protect your bags. And good morning to you, Gio. Nice to see you. Hey, Rebecca, good morning to you. Yeah, this traveler's luggage was stolen right from baggage claim, but that is not where this story ends. You see, he had slipped a small tracking device right into the bag. Take a look. This morning, a traveler and his stolen luggage reunited. I had about $3,000 worth of stuff in here. And it was all because of a small tracking device, an Apple AirTag. I just had it in my luggage because I just knew that I would probably need it one day. And luckily, it finally came to good use. Jamil Reed says he went to grab his bag from baggage claim at Atlanta's Hartsfield Jackson International Airport, but it was gone. He pulled out his phone and realized someone had taken it. I pulled out my phone and it was showing that it was at Grady Memorial Hospital. I was looking at it for a couple minutes and it was still saying, Grady, I'm like, okay, this is not looking too good. I'm starting getting a little nervous. As he kept tracking it, he saw the bag moving near the airport a couple of days later. He called police and was able to pinpoint exactly where it was. The suspect arrested. He had my shirt on, my jeans, and my socks. We've seen other examples of people finding their luggage the same way. Matt Maines traveled to Europe with his family, but their luggage never made it. The airline was completely unable to track my bags. Turns out he thought to put an air tag in their luggage. I was able to show them on my phone exactly where to look for the bags. Here's how it works. It usually uses Bluetooth to connect to your phone, but let's say it stays behind in California while you're traveling to New York. Apple says it then uses signals from other iPhones around it to tell you where it can be found. If you're checking luggage, if you're not putting an AirTag in it, uh, you are putting yourself at huge risk. The points guy, Brian Kelly, says he puts a tracker on just about everything, but says that's not all he recommends. Make sure you take a picture of your bag at check-in, preferably with the tag on it. Uh, so if it goes missing, not only can you point to your air tag and say, oh, it's at this airport, you can give them an exact picture of what the bag looks like. Having this will increase the chances of you getting your baggage back in a timely manner. Yeah, some good ideas ideas there. Now, meanwhile, the folks over at Atlanta's airport, they say they're constantly looking at security protocols, and if they have to make a change, they will, Rebecca. And Gio, we hear you're a big fan of tracking devices. That that sounds way <laughs> creepier than it actually is. We we know you use tracking devices for the right reasons. <laughs> For the right reasons, okay? <laughs> Listen, I'm one of those, I always lose my keys, and so I finally went ahead and I added an AirTag to the keychain. This costs about 29 bucks, and I gotta tell you, it saved me already. If you don't have an iPhone, there is another device, it's called Tile, and that starter kit goes for about eight, uh, 50 bucks or so. So it, it could be a really good investment if you're losing things like I do. Yeah. <laughs> always you, helping us not lose our- Something very important about GMA. <laughs> it always sounds different when you say it out loud. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I'm so grateful Very to important. learn it live here on television yes. with all of you. Thank you so much to you guys. Thanks to Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.